Somebody came and asked me to run for office because they were upset about some of the things that were going on at the time. Elected to the House of Delegates in 1978, Forehand has been focused on improving the quality of life for Rockville residents, whether it be through wellness initiatives or new technologies. We want to be sure that we get our piece of the pie, and we really do. We've gotten money for so many, uh, so many things. As a matter of fact, I was one of the people who helped get the Rockville Senior Center started in Woodley Garden, the old Woodley Garden School where my children had gone to elementary school. And uh, Bill Hanna was on the council at the time and I was in the legislature and so together we were able to secure that building for the future and uh, because it, if that happened today uh, we would not have that place. The big story with the state is still the budget, but Forehand says Maryland is in a better position than most. The budget is driving everything, and, and we indeed are, uh, we do have a budget problem. However, keep in mind that Maryland is probably better off than 45 other states. Uh, we still have a AAA bond rating. And our school, our K through 12 school system is number one in the nation for three years in a row now. Events like the District 17 night in Annapolis is important to Forehand and the rest of the delegation. And I think I've, I've played a role in having a, a higher level of cooperation with the state and, and, and somewhat with the county and uh, for the city, it's really, very important for, um, for the members of the mayor and council and for the delegation to work together. You just can't imagine how you can save something or you can keep something from happening. And as long as it's in the public interest, that, and that to me is, is that's where I draw the line. It's got to be in the public interest. Everyone should come visit the State House. And, and you know, we set up tours for people to come. And I've had several people come spend a day with me and at different times or, or we've set up meetings in Annapolis and for them and also back in Rockville. And, and I think it's important when the public understands the role and how important it is. I think that my background with all of the activities I was working on in, in the Rockville for the last 30 years. Well, actually, I've been in the legislature 32 years, so the last 40 years um, have paid off because I know people and I work very well with the mayor and council and, and others. I'm proud of Rockville.